Hello, I'm glad to share our work searching efficient 3D architectures with sparse point voxel convolution. 3D deep learning has received increasing attention thanks to its important real-world applications such as VR, AR, and autonomous driving. In these applications, both efficiency and safety are equally important. On the one hand, 3D deep learning models are usually deployed on the resource-constrained hardware and require low latency. Therefore, we need to design efficient algorithms that do not consume intensive computation. On the other hand, safety is the top priority in autonomous driving. However, previous methods often need to downsample the input scene on the left aggressively to a coarse green one on the right where small objects such as pedestrians and cyclists become indistinguishable. As such, existing state-of-the-art model, Minkowski net, can frequently ignore a nearby bicycle or pedestrian, as is shown in this video. This can lead to a very dangerous outcome. A real autonomous driving car hits a fake pedestrian which is ignored by its perception system during testing. In order to avoid such tragedies in the real world, we must have models that can efficiently recognize small objects on the road. To this end, we propose sparse point voxel convolution, or in short, SPVConf, an efficient 3D module that equips the low resolution sparse convolution with a high resolution point based branch. To exchange information between both branches, we propose the voxelize operation that converts the point cloud representation to the sparse tensor representation and devoxelize representation that transforms the sparse tensor back to a 3D point cloud. Both operations can be implemented very efficiently using a parallel hash table on the GPU. With just 4% computation overhead, the additional point-based branch is able to preserve fine details from large outdoor scenes. As is shown in these figures, the point-based branch learns to put its attention on small objects on the road, such as pedestrians and cyclists. Notice that these small objects are usually ignored by the sparse convolution branch, who puts its attention on only less than 10% of pedestrians, bicycles, and cyclists. We then propose 3D neural architecture search, or in short, 3D NAS, to design efficient 3D architectures built with sparse point voxel convolution. In the 3D NAS pipeline, we support searching for architectures with elastic number of channels and network depths. To achieve this, in 3D NAS, we decouple network training and architecture search. We train a super network that supports fine grained channel numbers and, and elastic network depths, and then search for the best network under efficiency constraints. Specifically, in super network training, we use weight sharing and uniform sampling techniques to jointly optimize a large number of subnetworks with different number of channels in our design space. We further support elastic network depths via progressive depth shrinkage. We divide super network training into three segments. In the first segment, the depths of each stage can only be three. In the second segment, we allow the depths of each stage to be two or three. In the final segment, the number of blocks per stage can be one, two, or three. As such, we support arbitrary network depth configurations in the 3D NAS super network. We then run evolutionary architecture search to find the best subnetwork under max constraint. Thanks to the super network trained with weight sharing and progressive depth shrinkage, we can directly grab the weights from the super network without retraining. This greatly saves the cost of 3D NAS. We demonstrate the results of our SPV NAS built from SPV Conf in the 3D NAS pipeline. We achieve eight times max reduction and three times speed up over the previous state of the art Minkowski NAS while preserving higher accuracy. 
This allows our model to be more efficiently deployed on real self-driving cars. We also break down the improvement from our better module SPVConv and the AutoML pipeline 3D NAS. By replacing sparse convolution in Minkowski nets with our SPVConf, we improve the trade-off curve from the gray line to the green line, achieving up to 2% IOU boost in the oil computation budgets. We then further boost the performance of SPVCNN using 3D NAS, which lifts the trade-off curve from the green line to the red line with up to 5% improvement under the same max or latency constraint. On smart objects, our SPV NAS achieves 5% to 25% IOU improvement over Minkowski nets. This will potentially make our SPV NAS much safer comparing with Minkowski nets when deployed on real cars. We also compare our SPV NAS with projection-based methods. While achieving 3% to 10% IOU improvement, our SPV NAS reduces the number of max by up to 58 times and the number of parameters by up to 46 times. We visualize the predictions of our SPV NAS comparing with Minkowski nets and observe that less error is made on safety-critical smart objects and boundary regions. Here is a live demo comparing our SPV NAS against previous state-of-the-art Minkowski net. Achieving higher accuracy, our SPV NAS runs three times faster than Minkowski net and achieves a throughput of 9.1 frames per second. We further compare our SPV NAS with projection-based darknet models. SPV NAS achieves over 10% IOU improvement with 46 times model size reduction and 42 times computation reduction. Our model also runs at 11.2 frames per second, which is even faster than the frequency of LiDAR sensors. We finally visualize the results of 3D object detection where our method achieves more accurate predictions in crowded scenes with many smart objects. In summary, in this paper, we propose a new lightweight 3D module, SPVConf, which can capture fine details in large outdoor scenes. We then propose the first AutoML method for efficient 3D deep learning, 3D NAS, to automatically design efficient neural networks built with SPVConf. We achieve state-of-the-art performance on a challenging Semantic Kitty leaderboard. We believe this work can have important impact in building efficient and safe autonomous driving systems. Please visit our project page, spvnas.mit.edu, for more details. Thanks for your attention.